As we adapt to our lives in a pandemic, businesses and churches have found alternative ways to get back to our new normal. In accordance with CDC guidelines, churches have decided to offer a safer option and are going digital. Churches around the world turned to streaming their services through Facebook Live or YouTube early on in the pandemic to remain connected with their congregation. In efforts to help their congregation and others, Novos Audio shifted the focus of their business from just installing sound equipment to installing and providing streaming services for churches. At first, it was a little bit challenging, but our customers led the way for us. So we knew that that was the way to go. Uh, and we focus on streaming and um, broadcasting. Antes de la pandemia, nuestros servicios eran más enfocados al área de sonido. Eh, y a raíz de la pandemia, vimos la necesidad en la comunidad cristiana y no cristiana en poder llevar un mensaje. Y nos enorgullece, ¿verdad? Que cada vez que vamos a una iglesia, instalamos, ver esa, esos pastores alegres, este, sabiendo que, que pueden llegar a, a su comunidad. Now, some have in-person services offered at different times during the week with a limited capacity. We never actually started live streaming until, uh, until about August. You know, that was when we first implemented like fully live. During COVID, we would do everything pre-recorded, so it wouldn't ever really be actually live. Um, we would just rebroadcast it and have moderators and to interact and everything. But the first time we actually went live stream was, was in August, and then we've been on live ever since. But it definitely was a little bit difficult to implement. Even to this day, we're still changing up like how we'll stream it just, just to make sure it's the best that it can be, but definitely has its challenges every Sunday. As more and more things are becoming virtual, how will this affect the future of places of worship? Well, I think that using technology is a powerful tool. It is uh, a good decision for churches to move digital. For South Florida Media Network, my name is Natalina Les Romero.